What's up, you all? And as requested, Miss Kelly Clarkson performing Saving All My Love For You by the one and only Miss Whitney Houston. Let's get right on into it. Music for you today. We will always I'm have confused as to why Jay Little well, you know is hosting Kelly Clarkson and, and introducing Kelly Clarkson on her own show. Uh, singing you know what I mean? One of my favorites. Saving All My Love For You by the incomparable Whitney Houston. Sing it Come on, Kelly. Wherever you are. Transitions under you are particular about this. You used to tell me we run away together. Love gives you the right to be free. Mm. You said be patient, just wait a little longer. But that's just in our fantasy. Come on. Come on. I got the, I got the. We can hear that song again because Whitney, like Kelly, is one of those people, the voice is just pure. You know, you don't need the, the background. Just hearing them sing. That's How true. Many, you ever go to hear somebody live in person and go, what? This sounds awful. And you yes. Know, it's, it's all, you know, electronic or, or it's mm -hmm. uh, heightened, they say. Mm -hmm. Yes, it's, it's enhanced. Mm -hmm. Well, not with Kelly and not with Whitney. Mm -hmm. That's why they're two of my favorites. That's true, that's true. It ain't nothing worse than going to hear somebody live and they don't sound, they sound like a completely different person. Uh, but I think most of us have been there and we ain't going back. Uh, with that being said, uh, I'm, you know, like I said, I'm really particular about the transitions on Whitney's songs and the phrasing on Whitney's songs. You know, I always say this, but to me, Whitney had the best diction, the, the, the best clarity of, of, of pronouncing uh, in her prime. And, and uh, uh, just transitions are, are just perfect. And Kelly, Kelly's transitions, every one of them were just so satisfying to me. Did a wonderful job with the transitions. And, and just her, her head voice has that purity and that clarity, yet it's not weak. It's not, it's not you know, it's got, it, it's, it's warmer, but it's clear at the same time, but not weak. You know what I mean? It carries weight. And and it's just that good mix that Whitney had, and, and Kelly has that as well. That good, fine mix of just the quality of the note. Uh, uh, and, and just did a beautiful job. Her vibrato, I really enjoyed her vibrato here. And, and, and you know, because that's another thing that I'm picky about with Whitney songs, too. The vibrato speed, is, she, the way she did it is just right. Um, she did a beautiful job. And I like the fact that she didn't do it exactly like Whitney. You know, a lot of people try to do it exactly like Whitney because, well, you know, Whitney's a standard, you know, especially on her own stuff, though, obviously. But, but you know, people be afraid to, to try to go out and do hers was her rendition was a little different. Uh, uh, and, and I appreciated that. And I think it paid off nicely. Kelly, Kelly Clarkson is just was one of the greatest singers today. Uh, uh, or any time. I mean, she would, I could easily see her just killing it in the 90s <laughs> with some of the greatest singers. You know what I mean? Just, I could see her being on stage with the Celine Dion, with the Whitney Houston, with the Mariah Carey, comfortably, just, just killing it herself. So, I mean, you know, we know Kelly can do it. I mean, if anybody can, it'll be Miss Kelly Carson. Thank you for liking and subscribing. Please continue to move your favorite space.